Hi, it's Alan here from Aussie V. I'm gonna take you through how you charge your Ford F-150 Lightning, whether it be at home or work. We have a modular kit that gives you three charging options. Option one is your 10 amp plug. Now your 10 amp outlet is the most commonly found outlet in Australia and most certainly in every single Australian home. Charging via a 10 amp overnight will give you approximately 100 kilometers of range. Option two is your 15 amp plug. Now 15 amp outlet is more commonly found in work sites or campgrounds and an overnight charge will give you approximately 150 kilometers of range. Option three is a 32 amp plug. Now a 32 amp plug will require an outlet installed by electrician, which will give you a full charge overnight. Now with these three AC charging options in this kit, you'll very rarely find yourself needing to go to a service station to DC charge. Now, whether you're the owner or driver of the Ford F-150 Lightning, there are some key elements you need to understand when it comes to fast charging. 95% of the charging you will do for this vehicle will be via AC and done at home or work. Now, on the odd instance where you do need to DC fast charge, you will need to go off site to places like this. So today I'm gonna to take you through the most common charges that you will find out in the road today. And I'm gonna start with the BP Pulse behind me. Now, when you drive the Ford F-150 Lightning in, please allow adequate room for the charge cable to meet the latch and the charging port. So first thing you need to do is download the BP Pulse app and connect your payment details to it. Now, once you've got that, you can locate via the app all your local BP Pulse charging station. Press the charge button and use it to scan the QR code on the charging station itself. You're then able to take the charging cable, connect it to the Ford F-150 Lightning via the latch and the charging port. To confirm you've got a successful connection, you are looking for a blue illuminated ring. That means it's successfully connected and you'll look for one portion of which will illuminate blue and flash. That means it's successfully charging. If you're not sure, you can look via the BP Pulse app, the BP Pulse charging station itself, or even on the dash of the Ford F-150 Lightning. And that will give you an estimated time for a 90% charge on the battery. So now to end your session with BP Pulse, simply go to the charging station, press the big red button saying stop charging, and then you go to the charging port, Press the unlock button, which will create a white ring and you disengage the charging cable. That then completes your charging session. Okay, so we're on site with the EV fast charging system. This is the most common of the fast chargers you'll find across the country. Like all these other charging platforms, they come with an accompanying app. Now on the app, you'll need to register and link a payment system. Now that can be credit card, Google Pay or Apple Pay. Now I'm gonna take you through the very quick and easy steps to charge your Ford F-150 Lightning. Now, when you drive up on site, You'll park your vehicle as close as you can to the charging station. You will then take your app and scan the QR code, which will link you to the appropriate charging cable. In this instance, like all others, it will be the CCS2 charging cable. Now you will need to press the button, look for a white rotating light, at which point you enter the cable into the charging port and wait for a sound to hear it lock. It's recommended that you hold that handle there until you see blue illuminated rings light up. Once that's done, wait another second or so before you release the charging cable and handle. Then you're ready to go. You'll then be able to confirm that it's charging and the associated time to get to 90% charge from either the platform, the app, or the Ford F-150 Lightning Dash. To end charging, simply press stop charging on the charging platform, go to the charging port, press the unlock button, wait for the white ring to start flashing in a clockwise motion and disengage the charging cable and you've completed your charging. We're here at an Ampol service center and behind me is the Amp Charge fast charging system. I'm gonna take you through the steps for you to fast charge your Ford F-150 Lightning. You're gonna to need to download the Ampol app. On that app, it will show you locations of their DC fast charging network across the country. So to begin charging, you need to take the CCS2 charging cable Open the latch on your Ford F-150 Lightning, engage it into the port and hold it there until you hear the locking sound. Once it's locked, you will see blue lights appear around the ring of the lock sign. That lets you know that it's actively charging. To check progress and how far you've got to go to charge and the corresponding cost, you can either view that on your app or the screen on the portal. Now you can go to the dash on the Ford F-150 Lightning and it will give you the corresponding finish time to charge to 90%. The Ford F-150 Lightning, like many EVs, has a percentage cutoff for DC charging. And that on the Ford F-150 Lightning is 90%. To go from 90 to 100%, you will need to revert to AC charging. 